Andrew Huberman in the house. If we're not enjoying it and we're just waiting for the end result, we're going to be unhappy. Well, absolutely. And there's something called dopamine reward prediction error where people work, 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 or they expect something to be great. And as you do that, you actually raise the level of dopamine that's required to make it feel good when you get there. This is why people, you know, achieve great things and kill themselves. It's crazy. You know, right? the, the failure to respect these neurochemical pathways and these neural pathways the, is actually, I mean, it, it's basically throwing away everything that we were given, in my opinion. And I don't want to give the impression that people have to follow these protocols because I'm talking about them. We were all given these, you know, people will sometimes ask me, they'll say, you know, is there an app or a product around this? And I just say, look, mother nature <laughs> has the patent for this, you know, <laughs> whatever people's beliefs, you know, this yeah. stuff was built into us for whatever reason. And we can use these different neurochemical pathways to organize our life in a way that really serves us and the people around us best. Yeah. And the gratitude practice can be one second long. It can yeah. be 10 minutes if you want. People do love and kindness meditation. Mm -hmm. I've never done that. I've always had a hard time being in meditation for a long period of time. I'm not good at mental visualization. Yeah. Um, so I tend to geared more towards behaviors. Wait, you, you're, a, you're a neuroscientist, you're not good at mental <laughs> visualization? Well, <laughs> well I, you know, I try, but I think some, we all differ in our ability to um, hold on to a ment mental imagery, mm -hmm. and mine's kind of fleeting, so I tend to write things out. But yeah, gratitude practice, I get try and get sun in my eyes. I mean, exercise, I love, I'm fortunate mm -hmm. that I love exercise and training. I think that got into me young. Um, for people that that's harder, to do, then you know you just build these things up through subjective reward. Yeah.